Researchers have uncovered a critical vulnerability in Apple's Vision Pro Mixed Reality headset that allows hackers to infer data entered on the device's virtual keyboard with over 80% accuracy. This flaw, officially named CVE-2024-40865, but dubbed Gazeploit by its discoverers, allows hackers to infer data entered on the device's virtual keyboard simply by analyzing eye movements. If you've ever dreamed of using futuristic eye tracking technology to type in virtual reality, you might need to watch this video first. In this video, we will uncover how a team of brilliant researchers cracked Apple's supposedly impenetrable Vision Pro, exploiting a flaw that turns your own gaze against you. Let's start by breaking down this mind-bending cyber threat that's given security experts nightmares. At the heart of it all is a vulnerability in Apple's Vision Pro, the mixed reality headset that promised to revolutionize how we interact with the digital world. This flaw, officially known as CVE-2024-40865, is like a hidden camera pointed directly at your eyes, capturing every flicker and movement as you type on a virtual keyboard. Now, you might be thinking, wait a minute, how can someone hack my eye movements? Well, that's where the genius and the danger of this exploit comes in. The researchers behind this discovery, a team of academics from the University of Florida, Surdex Skyfall team, and Texas Tech University, have dubbed their attack Gazeploit. And trust me, it's as creepy as it sounds. Here's how it works. When you're using the Vision Pro, you often interact with a virtual keyboard using just your eyes. It's a futuristic hands-free way of typing that feels like something out of a sci-fi movie. But here's the catch. The Vision Pro also creates a virtual avatar of you, a digital representation that mimics your facial expressions and eye movements in real time. The avatar is meant to make interactions in virtual spaces more natural and engaging. Imagine having a video call where instead of seeing a flat image of your face, the other person sees a lifelike 3D representation of you. Sounds cool, right? Well, it is, until you realize that this same feature can be exploited to steal your sensitive information. The researchers found that by analyzing the eye movements of these virtual avatars, they could reconstruct what the user was typing on the virtual keyboard. It's like a high-tech version of looking over someone's shoulder as they type their password. Except in this case, the shoulder is a digital avatar, and the person doing the looking could be anywhere in the world. But how accurate is this attack, really? Frighteningly so. The researchers achieved over 80% accuracy in keystroke inference across various typing scenarios. That means whether you're typing a simple message to a friend, entering a URL, or most worryingly, inputting a password or passcode, there is a good chance a hacker using this method could figure out what you're typing. Now, before we all panic and throw our VR headsets out the window, it's important to note that Apple has already patched this vulnerability in Vision OS 1.3 released on July 29, 2024. They describe the fix as suspending persona when the virtual keyboard is active. In other words, when you start typing, your avatar freezes, preventing would-be hackers from analyzing your eye movements. But here's the thing. The fact that this vulnerability existed at all raises some serious questions about the security of our increasingly connected devices. As we merge more and more of our lives with digital spaces, are we opening ourselves up to new and unforeseen risks? Think about it. We're living in an age where our devices are becoming extensions of our bodies and minds. The Vision Pro isn't just a screen you look at. It's a device that interprets your eye movements, understands your gestures, and creates a digital version of you. It's incredible technology, but it's also incredibly intimate. And as we have seen with Gazeploit, that intimacy can be exploited. But let's dig deeper into how this attack actually works because the technical details are both fascinating and terrifying. The researchers behind Gazeploit didn't just stumble upon this vulnerability. They meticulously crafted an attack that combines cutting-edge machine learning with a deep understanding of how we interact with virtual environments. Let's break it down step by step, and I promise, by the end of this, you'll be looking at your devices with a mix of awe and healthy paranoia. First up, the attack relies on two key biometric features extracted from the persona recordings. That's the technical term for those avatar videos. These features are the eye aspect ratio and eye gaze estimation. Now, if you're scratching your head wondering what those mean, 
don't worry, I've got you covered. The eye aspect ratio is essentially a measure of how open or closed your eyes are. It's calculated by looking at the relationship between the height and width of your eyes. This might seem like a small detail, but it turns out to be crucial for distinguishing between different types of eye movements. Eye gaze estimation, on the other hand, is all about figuring out where your eyes are looking. In the context of a virtual reality headset, this is how the device knows what you're focusing on in the virtual environment. It's what allows you to select items or type on a virtual keyboard just by looking at them. Now, here's where it gets really interesting. The researchers used a type of artificial intelligence called supervised learning to train a model that could distinguish between typing sessions and other VR activities like watching videos or playing games. They noticed something fascinating. When you're typing, your eye movements follow a distinct pattern. Picture this. When you're typing on a virtual keyboard, your eyes dart from key to key in a rhythmic dance. Your gaze becomes more focused, more concentrated. And here's a detail that blew my mind. You actually blink less when you're typing. It's as if your eyes are so focused on the task at hand that they forget to blink. The researchers took advantage of these patterns to build a model that could identify when someone was typing with scary accuracy. We're talking about 98.1% accuracy in detecting typing sessions. That's better than most humans could do just by watching someone. But identifying when someone is typing is just the first step. The real magic, or perhaps I should say the real danger, lies in figuring out exactly which keys they're pressing. And this is where the attack gets even more sophisticated. The researchers developed an algorithm that could calculate the stability of a person's gaze trace. In simpler terms, it could tell when your eyes were moving quickly between keys, what scientists call saccades, and when they were fixed on a specific key, known as fixations. By focusing on these moments of fixation, they could identify potential keystrokes with a precision rate of 85.9% and a recall rate of 96.8%. Now, if you're not familiar with these terms, precision essentially means how often the algorithm was correct when it thought it identified a keystroke, while recall refers to how many actual keystrokes the algorithm successfully caught. In other words, this algorithm is incredibly good at spotting when you're about to press a key with your eyes. But wait, there is more. The researchers didn't stop there. They went on to develop a method for mapping these eye movements to a virtual keyboard. This is trickier than it might sound because the virtual keyboard can be in different positions in the virtual space. So they came up with a clever solution. They used the average direction of your gaze to figure out where the keyboard was located and then used specific keystrokes like hitting the Q or P keys to determine its boundaries. The result was a system that could map your eye movements to specific keys on a virtual keyboard with uncanny accuracy. In their tests, they achieved a top 5 character prediction accuracy of 100%. Let that sink in for a moment. This means that for any given keystroke, the correct key was always among their top 5 guesses. And here's where it gets really scary. The researchers tested their attack on 4 different typing scenarios, message input, password input, email address or URL input, and passcode input. In other words, pretty much every type of sensitive information you might enter using a virtual keyboard. For a regular task on a QWERTY keyboard, their top guesses was correct about 65% of the time. If you include their top 5 guesses, that accuracy jumps to over 90%. For numbers and special characters, it's even more accurate. Over 75% of their top guesses and nearly 100% if you include their top 5 guesses. Let's put that into perspective. If you're typing a 6-digit PIN, an attacker using this method would have a pretty good chance of guessing it correctly on the first try. If they get multiple attempts, it's almost a certainty they'd crack it. But the implications of this attack go far beyond just guessing passwords. Think about all the information you might type in a virtual environment personal messages, confidential work emails, financial information, all of it could potentially be exposed. And here's the kicker. This attack doesn't require physical access to your device. It can be done remotely by analyzing the avatar video that might be shared during a video call, an online meeting, or even a live streaming session. In other words, any time you're using your Vision Pro to interact with others in a virtual space, you could potentially be exposing yourself to this attack. 
So what do you think? Are you still thinking about using Vision Pro for daily tasks? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel.